What's going on you guys? This is New York Adventure 1994 here. It is Wednesday, November 2nd, 2022. And this is a video I wanted to do yesterday, but apparently there was a lot going on with the tropics that I had to focus on that before this video. But for this video, I want to talk about that we are now in November. Halloween is completely over and this is now our, our kickoff to the holiday season. Yeah. November is usually what starts the holidays, like the kickoff to the holiday season. Like we prepare for Thanksgiving and then we prepare for our Christmas and New Year's. So yeah. People start feeling Christmassy in the middle of November, but for me, once Halloween's like over, I already start feeling Christmassy. I start watching Christmas specials and all that stuff, like starting in November. Yeah, usually in the middle of November, people start feeling Christmassy. And, but all, but mostly in November, like all of November, people start feeling the Thanksgiving spirit again about being with family and stuff. That's what Christmas and, and Thanksgiving is mostly about. Being with family, the most important thing. So, let's talk about what's happening in, in November for this channel. I know November is going to be a really active month for all of us. The first thing we have planned is we got daylight savings ending time, which means at 1 a.m. on Sunday, November 6th, like once it gets to 2 a.m., the clock will set back to 1 a.m., leading to an earlier sunrise and an earlier sunset. Which usually happens about like 4.30 in the afternoon and that's like, that's like pretty early for a sunset when you go into daylight savings end time. But the sunrise time seems normal because it's like at 6.30 over here when daylight savings ends. So we got daylight savings ending first which is November 6th at 2 a.m. And we still have the World Series going on. And sadly, the Phillies are leading that series. Hopefully, Houston could get their act together and win the last three. I really hope so. And... The biggest thing I want to go over with you guys is that... I've been I've been keeping it a secret for so long, but but now I'm ready to spill the beans of what's happening this month, and this is actually the biggest one. Okay, so on Wednesday, November 9, twenty twenty-two, I am going to Nashville, Tennessee, and Memphis too. So I will be leaving from November 9th through November 14th, which is the which is the Monday after the 9th. I'll be going Wednesday the 9th through Monday the 14th. Yeah, we booked this trip back in July, but I wanted to keep a secret, so I'm not jealousing anyone. Yeah, I kind of wanted to hide it till last minute, but. It's mostly last minute now, so I thought I spilled the beans now. So here's what's gonna happen. I will be flying Southwest Airlines out of LaGuardia Airport. My flight will be at 7.15 in the morning, and I should probably get there about like 8.30 according to that time zone. I think it might be 8.30. Nashville is like an hour difference from us. Yeah, it's only a two hour flight. So I should be getting there about like 8 30, 9 o'clock. And I am checking into a red roof inn near the airport. And I think that Thursday, 
we're gonna be renting an SUV and we'll probably visit some museums and stuff or probably go to the zoo or whatever. I, I don't know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna see when I get there. We'll probably go to some musical museums or something. And we will be eating at some restaurants too. And on Friday the 11th on Veterans Day, I will be going to Memphis, Tennessee to, to go to Graceland for the Elvis Mansion. I will be seeing the Elvis Mansion in Graceland when I get over to Memphis on that Friday on Veterans Day. It will be a three and a half hour drive and we will be taking our rental over there and then come back when the day is done. Yeah, the Elvis Mansion is the biggest thing. I am an Elvis fan, as we all know. I am a really big Elvis fan, guys. I listen to his music, like, almost every day. And I never get tired of it. That's how much I love Elvis. I could listen to his songs all day. And then, that Saturday, I will be going to the Rangers at Nashville Predators game at the Bridgestone Arena. And then the 13th, we would do whatever we... I don't know what we're doing on Sunday 13th, our last full day, but we'll just do it there. And then the 14th, I'll be heading back to New York and... My salad's flight back to LaGuardia will be at 6 o'clock in the morning, so... I have a really early flight going back home. I'm gonna have to be at the airport about like 3.30 in the morning in Nashville. So yeah, I have a Nashville trip to go on this month. And then, what I'm also excited about is that they're making a new Black Panther movie. Which is, which is another thing I'm excited about this month. Marvel's making a Black Panther 2, and I hope to see it in theaters pretty soon. And then the 24th is Thanksgiving. Which is another thing I'm looking forward to. I can't wait to have turkey, be with family. I mean, I can't wait to be with family, have some turkey. Watch the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. And I know that the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade this year, they have a really good lineup. I'll be sure to gain I'll be sure to get a lot for you guys this parade. I am really looking forward to the parade. But most importantly, being with family. While we're sitting at the table having that turkey. And there is the dog show, but I don't really watch the natural dog show. All I do is get up at 8.30 in the morning, tune into Channel 4, watch the parade, and then prepare for dinner, and then have the feast with the family. That's how it always works. So yeah, November is really going to be an active month for us. There's a lot to look forward to. With the kickoff before Christmas. The kickoff to the holidays, which is November. November is the kickoff to Christmas month. Where everybody starts feeling all Christmassy. I'm starting to feel Christmassy, like, right now. But first, we gotta get through Thanksgiving. And then before you know it, December will be here. And then we'll go through Christmas, and then New Year's Eve. And then it will be 2023. So we have a lot to look forward to guys. So I guess that's it. And we are in the last month of hurricane season. And we are at the peak of the NFL season. As well. So I can't wait for Thanksgiving. All this other stuff coming up. And I guess that's it. Bye.